People from underdeveloped regions of Pakistan took to the streets to press their demand to decentralize federal power structure by creating new provinces. People from the backward areas, particularly from the southern and northwestern part of Pakistan, are complaining that the bigger provinces have been diverting their share of national funding to the already developed region. These public outcries have been finally heard by the parliament, where political analysts believe that the ruling alliance is using this demand as a campaign to win next general election. They are building up pressure on the parliament to amend the constitution to create more provinces out of existing four provinces. We are asking to get our right. If they will not give this is a peaceful demonstration, then if you are going to build frustration, we don't want to, these are all charged youth. We want respect for vote. If you are there in the parliament and if the parliament is supreme in other matters, why not on that people's demand? This is our legitimate demand to form a Saraiki province. The ruling alliance has moved a resolution in the parliament to create two more provinces out of eastern province of Punjab and another from northwestern province of Khyber Pakhtunkhwa. The government needs two-third majority not only in the federal parliament but also in two provinces, something easier said than done. In principle, no political party in the parliament is opposing the move to form new provinces. But how many provinces should be made and on whether those should be created on administrative grounds or linguistic basis is a subject of controversy in Pakistan. If we do not pay heed to such voices, they will uh, become source of instability, will lead to chaos and God forbid there may be more Bangladesh, Bangladesh in the offing in Pakistan. More Bangladesh can come out of Pakistan. Not long ago, people resorted to rise in parts of the country to press their demand to create new provinces. Javed Rana, Press TV, Islamabad.